Goodwill stores can be a treasure trove of fun and unusual finds and always a great value. A new Goodwill store is opening here on the Sun Coast with a more specific focus. Veronica Brandon Miller is here with good news from Goodwill for art and book enthusiasts. So tell us about this new store. Well, we're very excited. It'll be the very first art and bookstore for Goodwill, Minnesota. Wow. And it, it came because we, we closed the Manatee store to open up further down on Cortez mm -hmm. for a bigger selection. And the community was in love with our bookstores. So we already kind of knew we wanted to do books, mm -hmm. but it's such a cultural community, so we added art. And nice. since then, so many wonderful uh, donors have been donating their collections. Oh, and wonderful. we're looking for more. We're always looking for wow. more. That's well, let's bad. take that a look is. at some of the things you brought because uh, we have some pictures down here. Tell me about those. Okay, so that is very cool. We were going through a selection, um, and Al Konetsky, am I saying his name right? Al Konetsky. Uh, yes. See, we were discussing this earlier. He was actually a Disney artist living here, right here in Sarasota. Unfortunately, he died a year ago, but fortunately, he donated most of his collection to Goodwill. Oh, so that's amazing. Yeah. They're, nice they're all thing. signed and printed. His claim to fame also, he's the one who created the lunchbox set. Mm -hmm. I remember having one. Yeah, and absolutely. the Disney characters on the bus, that was him. Oh, so. wow. He was such a nice man. We yeah. interviewed him several times. And, but these things are like so oh, valuable. Yeah. Now, I, what is this that we're looking at? Oh, it's uh, a print from Ringling Brothers and Barnabas Bailey Circus. I can never get those words out. But those who love art, look at this. I wish you could really see this up front because the colors are just amazing. There's a lot of really nice artwork, amazing yeah. artwork. Look at this one. Aren't they still great values? Because they look like oh, they, yes. they look so valuable. Oh, that's Absolutely. beautiful. Absolutely. This, this was donated through um, a, an advised donor fund from mm. Sabadell Trust, but literally, guess how big that is? How big? <laughs> it's it looks like, like really long. big. 12 yeah. feet long. Or 12 feet? It, it, it's 10, 10, a little over close, 10. Close it down. is huge, but talk about like brilliant colors oh. for your living room, oh yeah. yeah. But also we have fabulous books. Oh, look at this. You uh, have other bookstores. Yes, But we this do. is the first book and art. Book and art. So will this be more high-end in terms of your book selection? Because I noticed a lot of these are very historic. Well, it'll be still be the same, so you can always get, get a variety. You know, a variety. Okay. Yeah. Wonderful. Tell us about the books you brought. I, I brought unique books. Because, yes, you know, right. sure, yeah, you still have the Janet Abonovich. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's funny. I was going to get that for you, hon. Okay. <laughs> But the first one um, that Pam's holding, that's from 1803. Oh, Talk wow. about rare and unique. Pam, don't open touch it that. Up. It, looks <laughs> like, <laughs> it actually looks like a typewriter I'm when kidding. you open. Oh. Yeah. Oh, the way yeah, the type so set is. It's very valuable, yeah. I would oh, yeah. think. No pictures whatsoever. So. Well, because <laughs> oh, the dream of the world's tragedy. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Light <laughs> reading. Yeah. And the next the one. one. Oh, is that the Sarasota? The story of Sarasota, and it goes to 1946. So talk about the historians who really want to dive yeah. into it. That is fabulous. And some of the pictures are, are oh, super. Oh. So I love what people donate. Just think about mm -hmm. what a collective community we have and what Did they Did they donate. still have problem with and the snowbirds? Yet, but <laughs> the left lane with the blinker on. Look I this. like this one. Yeah. This one is really fun. Oh, that's fun. This is one of the pop-up books. It's Looks like one pop -up of the original yes. pop-up books. Yes. Okay, look at this. This really? is called Table Lay Yourself. And which is you a open weird title. Oh. Yeah. And and look Aww. and there this looks like Ooh, it's very fashion. Very it. old. It, it it looks like it's really, really old, but it's from the nineteen sixty. Not that bad, but oh yeah, but yeah, that's that not adorable? that old. No, no it's not. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's, right, right, right. <laughs> it's like archaic. I already had children <laughs> that were looking at books like this at that time. Yeah, but and look, it's still in 
Excellent. Yes. Excellent. Oh, oh, I love this. I could spend all day with this. Up. But tell me about this one now. Oh, that, that's funny. It says Lawyers and Legends of oh, Sarasota. Oh. Lawyers and yeah. Legends? I did that. No it, comment. Yeah. I, <laughs> we want to start looking at names oh. and stuff. But as you can see, Life Magazine More from Ringling. 1945. Ringling. A lot of great Ringling. stuff. Oh. oh, you've got to see this place. I will be there shopping. Thank you so much. June it's, 22nd. It, it opens. opens June 22nd. June 22nd. Okay. I see a field trip. Okay. <laughs> hey, the book and art Goodwill store is going to be on Manatee Avenue in Bradenton. You can get more information from Goodwill's website. And next, this weekend's McCurdy's headliner joins us for a good laugh, and we sure need that. Woohoo!